like a shark in a shrimp tank. Big fish, small pond in the shrimp tank. When it take a swim, only option is to win. Hello. Welcome to the post-show wrap-up of the Seattle Shrimp Tank Podcast. I'm Dan Whedon, along with my partner in crime, coming in out of the bullpen to help out with Brad Berger gone, J.B. Wilson. Welcome, J.B. Hello, thank you. This has been a fun day we've had with our guest, Dr. Craig Adams, owner of the Paulsville Animal Clinic. Craig, thanks for, for taking part today. Oh, thanks, Dan and JB. It was a lot of fun. Absolutely. You know, uh, we had a wonderful 40-minute podcast, which you need to go to at our website, www.seattle.shrimptankpodcast.com. Listen to the whole thing. We're going to give you a few highlights here, and I'm going to ask Craig a question related to the veterinarian industry. Uh, from the outside, Craig, it seems like all veterinarian clinics are the same, but there's really been quite a change in the industry, hasn't there? Well, for sure. A lot of our industry is really going to a corporate type mentality. There's a few companies that own a large share of our market, uh, but we, we like to differentiate ourselves. Uh, we offer a lot of services that, you know, maybe the, the, the standard veterinarian doesn't. I'd like to do a lot of uh, Orthopedic surgeries, for example, fracture repairs, um, repairing torn cruciate ligaments, things like that. A lot of people are having to travel a couple of hours to Seattle to get done, and we're able to take care of them you know, close to home in Hallsville. You, you know, to, to that point, Craig, one of the things that, that we talked about in, in the podcast is the, the difference in the relationship that you have with your clients versus some of the bigger box commercials. So talk a little bit about that, of how you're unique in that way. Well, sure. I mean, we get to know our, our clients, not just because we want their business, but because we live in the same community. We like, we like to get to know them, and it's fun to uh, interact with them at work. So we get to enjoy the time that we spend with them, and they get to know us, and you know, really on a first-name basis. Well, well, you'll be glad to know, Craig, that uh, Captain Jack... Your favorite Jack Russell terrorist. <laughs> For sure. Uh, Captain Jack was listening to you, and when your voice came on, he barked. So I want you to know that he's listening. So you've developed a very good relationship with, with my dog. Uh, yeah, good. Speaking about relationships, sure. you have a young family. Your, your wife, Bethany, is also in the business, and you have four young children that you're homeschooling. Talk about the whole life balance issue, being an entrepreneur, both parents, uh, owners in that, and trying to, to, to teach and mold your kids. Yeah, you know, Bethany is a very accomplished veterinarian. She's very good at it. Uh, she's one of the smartest people I know. And she spends a tremendous amount of effort um, with the homeschooling aspect of it. We, we, we really enjoy owning our own practice together because it gives us that flexibility. And you know, JB, I think one of the things most of our guests have talked about is one of the great things about being an entrepreneur is the ability to be flexible. Absolutely. Absolutely. And so to that point, one of the things that uh, we always like to do here on the show is uh, learn a little bit more about you. So where can people do that in addition to listening to the podcast uh, to find out more about the clinic? Sure. Uh, PaulsboAnimalClinic.com. Paulsbo is spelled P-O-U-L-S-B-O. PaulsboAnimalClinic.com. Or we're also on Facebook. Excellent. Everybody, listen. We're going to be gone for a couple weeks just because of the way the calendar works. Our next episode will be on May 10th. We have Earl Bell. Uh, Earl is, a, is a, a fabulous coach, mentor, and a baseball junkie. We're going to learn a little bit more about Earl and his practice. Uh, please listen to the podcast. Get it on iTunes, rate us high, and keep watching. Again, thanks to Dr. Craig Adams of the Paul's Boy Animal Clinic. Thanks to my partner in crime today, J.B. Wilson. The hay is in the barn. I've been feeling like a shark in a shrimp tank.